I welcome all of you on platform of your PD education and this video is related to the positions of apprenticeship, graduate apprenticeship and even for you know uh, ITI and diploma students uh, in DRDO lab that is gas turbine research establishment which is a prestigious lab of DRDO in Bangalore and uh, this is uh, uh, you know the position for uh, apprentice for one year. So now uh, why you should join it, what is the reason and uh, you know what, what is the advantage of that. Uh, though scholarship is very less and it is only temporary post of uh, one year. But those of you who are looking forward to join higher education courses, let's say masters or direct PhD, their BTEC uh, academics is good. This post you cannot apply at higher education, higher qualification. Let's say if BTEC is the qualification, MTech students may not join it. ITI is the requirement then you know graduate cannot join it. So if your BTEC and your academics are good, your CGP academics are good, then on the basis of that shortlisting will be done. The moment you get into the lab, then you join that lab for one year, you may learn something good in that and you may do some project or research work there. On the basis of that, you may get some kind of position, masters or PhD position in foreign university or Indian, Indian university, that is the advantage of this. So why you should do for this is, it adds to your CV, it gives some kind of credibility, uh, academic credibility, research exposure, research experience to you and that can be added in your CV. Now let me read out this uh, uh, you know advertisement. So uh, I think 14th March is the last date for that. So graduate apprentice training, uh, BTEC or equivalent is the qualification requirement and uh, you know you should be having degree in uh, last three years only not late, uh, later than that. So mechanical 30 post, aeronautics, electronics, computer science, these are the positions, total 75 and diploma apprentice is also there for diploma uh, students in these branches. So total 20 positions and ITI apprentice training also these positions are there. So age criteria and uh, reservation criteria, everything is mentioned here. And there are journal streams also like commerce and uh, science graduates also there are some uh, you know uh, apprentice uh, 30 positions are there so uh, all the reservation is as per the rules only and uh, i think you can go to uh, you know this there is no employment that everywhere they mention that there is no employment guarantee and you should have degree in last three years that is important that you should know candidates with higher qualification are not eligible so if btech is qualification mtech cannot apply that is uh, one thing you need to know so no TADA is given for interview or document verification. There can be interview, there can be document verification. So if there is an interview, you know, you can prepare with your PDA very well for that. And engineering stream may 9,000, 8,000, 7,000 rupees will be given to you. As I told you, uh, this uh, scholarship is not, you know, the reason why you should go for it. And, uh, you know, uh, another reason is candidates with more than one year experience are not eligible to apply. So actually uh, the main purpose of these kind of things is to give you job exposure. Uh, so you should not have earlier job experience. Selection process they have explained depending upon your you know background academic background you may get shortlisted. You need to see the website of DRDO for uh, whether you have got selected or not. So how to apply there is you have to go on this site and you have to you know uh, you have to um, um, fill the some details about you something like marks and CGPA you have got. On the basis of that, you will get shortlisting. There are some, uh, you know, uh, uh, certificate requirements, documents which you have to attach. Uh, go through these documents. These are the documents which you have to attach along with your application. That is uh, what is required. Uh, rest is more or less the same things they are mentioning about this. Yes, these last important dates are important for us. So, uh, application of online application is 14th March. First list will be declared 25th March, you can join by 31st March, so that is how all uh, details they have provided. So I think this is a detail about uh, you know apprenticeship positions in DRDO, those of you which are looking forward to plug the gap, learn, have a learning, uh, to pursue career in higher education, a master's doctorate in India abroad, they can join it and if they are not doing anything else, this can be one of the options. So you can go for that. Thank you.